Morning gang, so it's Jay, and I'm going to go over my uh, quick setup for my J-pole antenna for my radio. Great, great thing with the J-pole antenna is you can put it up just about anywhere. It gives you a bit of stealth out in the back country. It also helps increase your reception distance and your uh, transmission distance. So by being able, we all know that um, you know that your ham radios uh, work off the line of sight. Obviously, when you're dealing with, excuse me, dealing with uh, VHF there. And the great thing here is this gets your uh, line of sight up quite a bit higher. Instead of just being at your handheld level, um, gets it up another 12, 15 feet and allows you greater distance then. Uh, great for quick, easy communications while out in the field. Great for a base camp setup. You can really do a multitude of things with it. And the uh, great thing really is it requires a hunk of paracord or a bank line or whatever else you might have. Your coax cable with an antenna on it to help get your... Uh, help get your distance for your height. Um, I use a carabiner as my weight for throwing the rope up over a, uh, a, li a limb on a tree uh, instead of tying a rock or something like that. It's quick and easy and then uh, a stuff sack for keeping it all in. I mean the whole package weighs I want to say like three ounces that's it. So it works out really easy for infield communications um, whether you're using your radio on um, FRS, GMRS, mirrors, or you're using the ham bands, you can uh, take care of it all right here. Also great for improving your signal if you're using it as a scanner, um, whether you're listening to EMS, uh, fire, police, or if you're working on a search and rescue team and you uh, just need to reach out a little bit further or be able to need to be able to listen in on details of something, this can increase your range dramatically. Even if you're not uh, ham licensed, you can at least still listen to communications. And that's uh, that right there just the knowledge, the knowing what's going on is really half the battle. Jeez, oh man, it puts you ahead of everyone else in the game. So I'm going to throw it up real quick just so you can see how easy it is. Hopefully I get it in my first or second try. It doesn't always work out that way, but, you know, it is supposed to be quick and easy. So let's have at it, all right? Up. Make sure you get all the bends out of it, coils. backpack as a quick anchor. got reception. So right now I'm just on the local weather station. 
that's what I listen to a lot while I'm out in the woods. But if I'm wanting to change stations, just a simple up down. Obviously, for getting my different channels that I have pre programmed, all the different uh, local county emergency units. local rangers for the uh, local park district so it's all in here so it works out for a great and efficient con setup here you can tell i'm up 12 feet so i've just gained a, a lot of distance from this spot right here i know that i can reach a repeater that's about 15 miles away works out great so and to be able to link up beyond there the possibilities are endless So guys, it's really that simple for being able to take any handheld unit and uh, be able to increase your communications distance. Um, you know, you're out with the kids and the family in the local park, throw up a J-Rig, a J-Pole antenna and uh, increase your communications. That way you know you can at least hit, hit the entire park. Um, makes a huge difference. You can, I mean, any radio frequency, you're going to be able to transmit off of it or receive off of it. So just for something that's so simple and lightweight, you can buy them. You can buy pre-made ones on Amazon, on eBay. There's a lot of dealers out there who do them. You can make your own if you have the skills. Um, the particular one I have was made by a buddy of mine. Um, thank you very much, HL. And, um, you know, it's good stuff. Good to go. Great to practice on. Great to learn on. Get the kids involved. And uh, increase your skills out there in the woods with your communications. So that's it. Thanks for watching, guys. And we'll chat with you later. Thanks.